So on the left side, we have the reluctance path example, and on the right, we have the non-reluctance path. So because the fields are north and south, what's happening is the field, the magnetic field has been confined within the washers. And I can demonstrate this by, I have this steel plate here and I'll just try to lift it up. Can't lift it up. The magnetic field is confined within the washers. There's no attraction. However, if I take the other assembly here with the two north facing mag, um, or the same poles, can be south or can be north as long as they're the same poles, you can see that it easily picks up this steel plate. So we take that concept and we can 3D print a case, as you see in yellow here, and a simple switching device. It's the green, and I've glued in to a recess within the case those three um, washers that I talked about. And the arrow here points to the direction of magnetism. So at the moment, um, the reluctance path is on and therefore we're not getting any attraction because the magnetic field is confined within the washers. If I then turn on or turn off, sorry, turn, turn, turn on the magnetic forces but turn off the reluctance path, you can see the arrow is pointing down, then now oh, we have our magnetic attraction.